Okay, now, this is what I want to show you. Here's the GFI. I've connected it to this plug here. See these little pigtails here? I went from the top screws here now, the top of this, over to this top plug. Attach it to the top. Okay? Now when I put that in, it's going to line up like that. So now this GFI plug is now going to power this top of the plug here. Okay? So that's what you got to do. You got to make some pigtails. You got to line them up. You may have to try a couple different times. Cut them a little long and then put it together because see, you got to line it up like that. So we're going to push this all in as one unit. Okay? So that's kind of how that's going to go. Here's the next thing I want you to see. Okay, before we're going to screw that in, now remember, there's a little tab right there. We've got to break that tab off because we only want power from this GFI to the top of this plug because the bottom of this plug is going to be controlled by the light switch inside the unit. Okay? That's what we're doing here. And um, so we've got to break this tab off. Once you break that tab off, this has separate power. So then, you, then we have to connect from our light switch to this screw here. Now, on the neutral side, there's a tab on the neutral side, but we're not going to break that off. You don't have to break that off. But we're just going to take our other two wire, white wires, we're going to put a pigtail on there, come out with one wire, and we're going to attach that to this screw here. That way, all the neutral side is hot all the time. The GFI plug is connecting to this plug. The entire, uh, well, the top area and the neutral side of the bottom. So now, if anything ever happens outside, this plug is going to be GFI protected as well as the light switch. Okay, think about what I'm doing here and it will all come together. Okay, so our next step is we're going to cut these two off and put another little pigtail on like we did before. To these two white wires. I don't know if you can see that right there. I broke that tab off. I bent it back and forth. I had to take some some dikes and gently back and forth and uh, break that off. Okay. Now that means there's not going to be any hot power. Not going to be any hot power to that from the GFI. This is going to be controlled by the light switch in there. We're going to call the light switch the curly Q1. Okay, that's going up to our light switch inside. So this curly Q1 is going to attach to the bottom here. So we're going to screw that on to that screw there. Okay, so it's all going to come into place, isn't it? Okay, so that's going to line up I put my wire nut on this, I tightened it up here a little bit extra. Now I'm going to shove this in there. This white wire, you remember, is going to go on this screw over here. So that's what we're going to do that. You remember that other white wire, this other white wire is going to go to the bottom of this GFI. That was where that wire was from before. Okay. So we got just about everything figured out. But let me push this back in and I'll tell you uh, what we're going to do with this other black wire. Okay, if you were paying close attention, I did the black wire incorrect and I wanted to see if you could catch that. Okay, you've got this one here is going to be for the bottom plug, okay? This one. That's for the bottom plug. So follow this through. A wire white wire, or hot wire coming in, and the white wire in the box originally is going to be attached to the bottom of this plug from before. 
going to come out of the top of the plug to hit the top of this plug. We also have to have a hot wire going up to the light switch. And that's what this other black wire is for. Okay? So this black wire has to be plugged in to this top plug. So what we've got to do is we're going to come off of there with the pigtail because see we've already attached the screw here from here to here okay so we need to go from here from the top of this uh, GFI we have to connect in to this black wire here and also to the top of this plug here so we're gonna come off of here with two pigtails that's what we're gonna have to do Okay, these two black pigtails connected to the wire that is going up to the switch. Okay, tighten that up a little bit. Got that nice and snug. Now we got to fish that in the box there too. Down in there like that. Okay, so one of those wires is going to go to the top of this plug of the GFI and one of the wires is going to go to the top of this plug and that's going to go up there to the light switch then the, that means the light switch is GFI controlled too protected because from the light switch when it comes back down we're going to connect the light switch wire coming back down feeding the bottom of this plug from the light switch now this this bottom of the plug when you turn the light switch on this will also be um, GFI protected is it all coming to coming a little clearer now I'll hook these wires up and I'll explain it one more time but uh, I think I want to get rid of these wires here or actually I'll keep everything separate now I think we can go ahead and connect the ground wires. Okay, this ground wire is going to go to this plug, and this ground wire here is going to go to this plug. Okay.